What is up everyone? This is Totally Random back here with another video, but uh, today we got the Artemis Fowl official trailer. Um, yeah, the dislike to like ratio is really, really bad on this movie. Um, yeah, I did a reaction to the uh, teaser trailer that they had last year, you know. I liked it, I was excited. Um, I'm a fan of the books, I read it growing up, so I want it to be good, you know. I don't know if this is going to be good or not. The first trailer I thought it was, but then I hear all this backlash and stuff about the about the movie, and we'll see. Uh, I I I didn't like the casting for that they did for their, some of the some of the roles, but that wasn't a big deal. But yeah, I just I just don't want them to ruin this. You know, I, growing up as a kid, you read these books, you just want it to be like like the books, uh, like. I mean, there's so many examples out there of where, like, hey, if you don't make the book like the movie, if you don't make the movie like the book, you know, it doesn't do well. Like, Percy Jackson is probably, like, the prime example of do not change the book up in the movie. You got to keep it like the book, you know. That's what the fans, the fans want, you know, you're adapting what these fans love. You got to put what the fans love in the movie. You don't change it up. But uh, hopefully this is not like that where they changed up the whole entire, you know, plot and stuff. But we'll see. I mean, this is my childhood right here, guys. Like, I read this as a kid, you know. And so, Disney, please do not, do not ruin this. All right. Here we go. We want to know everything about the man you work for. The man? Oh, oh no. This isn't about the father. This is about the son, Artemis Fowl. Grown strong, son. And smarter than I ever imagined. Then take me with you. You're all I have now, Artie. There's just one very important thing I have to do. Authorities launched a worldwide manhunt for the famous collector. He is suspected to have been behind some of the biggest robberies ever. Hello? Your family has taken something of great value from us. Return it to me or I will destroy everything you love. You weren't supposed to see this yet. Your father is in a complicated profession. For years, he has protected powerful secrets that have kept mankind safe from no. the dangers of another world. It's time to face your destiny. Now look around, this is what they call greatness. But we are not alone in this. Mulch Stidham's just a talented giant dwarf. And I'm Holly Short, your ally on the other side. Ally? It's real. All right, save my father, save the world. Whole team ready, tell them we are dead. Scared, Artemis? I prefer scared to dead. An army is coming. Dad! You think you can beat us? We'll see. Who do you think you are? I'm the next criminal mastermind. Now look around, this is what they call greatness. I didn't read much on trolls. Anything I should look out for? The teeth. They eat people. Good Whoa. to know. First of all, screw this movie. Screw Kenneth Branagh. For, that 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 was that was garbage. That was literal trash. That was the the exact opposite of what I want. Like Percy Jackson was better. I can already tell was better than that garbage. What the Artemis Fowl? He wants to be a criminal. Ma like. Holly is his ally. Holly, the that's not even how the book goes. If you guys have read the book, he captures Holly, and that's how this whole thing starts off. This is like his father's protecting the fairy. None of them even know about the fairy world. Like the whole. That that was that was garbage. That was trash. That like how inaccurate do you want this movie to be? Like. You're just ruining Disney is ruining this this is like a classic amazing fantasy book. Like Artemis Fowl, he said I prefer 
I prefer Scared to Death. That's like the least Artemis Fowl thing to say. Like, Ar if you've read the book, Artemis Fowl is a literal genius. Like, he doesn't say stupid shit. He he says like like the most like whoa that like baddest lines ever. Like, you can't trick Artemis Fowl into doing anything stupid. Like, he knows everything. He is like the smartest guy. Like the and the fact he, they were had him training in the beginning of the movie. Like, or in the better in the beginning of the trailer. Like, what Artemis Fowl is not like a. A martial arts dude, okay? He's smart, but he isn't a martial arts. That's what he has his bodyguard for. And uh, his father. His father in the book. He doesn't even get captured. It's not even by fairies or anything. I'm assuming in the movie they're having him captured by fairies. And he's defending their secrets or whatever. And in the, mo in the book, he's captured by some... I can't even remember. Like another criminal person. Um, drug dealer. I don't even remember. But it's nothing with the fairies. And... Artemis Fowl already knew that his father was a criminal mastermind. Like, he was a criminal family. Like, they, it was pretty, like, they all knew this. And it sounds like he's getting introduced to it for the first time. And it's... Screw this movie. Screw everyone who's doing this. Screw, like... Just stop. Just stop with this. This is pathetic. Oh, my gosh. The comment section. He, this is Artemis Fowl is a cold, calculating, manipulative, evil mastermind who acts like a twenty-year-old stuck in a twelve-year-old body. Now he's in this. He's a helpless person who needs to be shown the secrets of his family, which he already knows. And uh, he's the person who discovers the fairy world. Nobody in our world knows about the fairy world. He's the one who figures it out. Why do they have to f him up so much? Oh my gosh. Dude, Disney, if you're listening, the best thing for you to do right now is to po postpone this movie, can't delay it, and reshoot the movie completely. Like, this is ridiculous. I know, you, you're you so rich, you can do this. You can save this movie. Like, this is, this is one of my favorite series. Like, you can redo this. You can fix it. You don't have to butcher it like this. You don't have to make this movie flop when it comes out in May. You can delay it and push it to, like, December or next year. Dude, look at what they did with uh, Sonic. They changed it up. You know, I know this is definitely more complicated because you have to reshoot scenes and story because you have to fix a story. But still, you can make a profit off of this. Don't put this in theaters. Do not put this crap in theaters. I do not want to see this crap in theaters. If I hear about this crap before the movie comes out with, like, reviews and stuff, I'm not going to go watch this movie. I w this, this is not how you adapt a book to a movie. Jeez, okay? Look at Harry Potter. Look at Hunger Games. Look at Lord of the Rings. Look at um even the Maze Runner trilogy. Even though they did change up that uh in the second book and the third third book, they still were true to what the author wrote. They didn't change it up so rapidly where it was like a different entire character. You're changing up Artemis's character. You're changing up the whole story. You're changing up everything. Please do not do this. Fix this. Please, please, please fix this crap. Fix this crap. I'm begging you to fix this crap. And, you know, you will be getting my praise and the praises of a thousand, millions, millions of fans around the world. But yeah, guys, you guys let me know your thoughts down below with whatever you want to say. If you agree with me or not, uh, make sure you give me a thumbs up. I hit the subscribe button. Make sure to ring the bell for notifications. Follow me on Twitter and Instagram. Those links are down below. <laughs> I just com one comment said, Artemis Fowl fandom, but they changed everything. Percy... Jackson fandom, welcome to the club. That that's that's like literally what I'm talking about right here. You no, know, but Percy Jackson fandom, this is this ours wasn't as bad as what they're doing to this. This is worse. This is like three times worse. This is mega times a a gazillion worse. You know, please fix this mess. Please fix this mess. I, I did you even read the book? Did you even read the book? Did you did you actually read the book? Kenneth Branagh, did you read the book? I'm not surprised if the movie comes out and, you know, from a neutral perspective, from a perspective of a person who's never, ever read the books in their life is going to say, oh, that was a good movie. You know, I don't, I, I'm not surprised if that's what they get, but you, this is based on a book. This is based on a popular kids fantasy book. You know, this is super big. Like it has millions and millions of fans around the world. A lot of fans are my age today because this book came out when we were all kids, you know, so just fix this shit, fix it. Fix it, fix it, fix it, fix it. It's not it's not rocket science to do reshoots and fix this crap. You have time to fix this. Please, please fix this. Do not let this be like Percy Jackson. Do not let this be like 
Uh, I mean, Percy Jackson's the biggest thing that come to mind because Percy Jackson was so popular. It was in line to be like the next Harry Potter thing, but they they effed it up. Now, uh, please don't let Artemis Fowl do that. But yeah, let me know your thoughts down below. Uh, hit the subscribe and do all that stuff. Um, and I'll see you in another video soon. Hopefully, uh, this movie comes out. I just, uh, just, 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 but yeah, until next time, guys, be amazing.